Have you guys ever wondered how expensive it is in Japan? Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how expensive it is to buy groceries in Japan by comparing the Tokyo supermarkets versus the countryside supermarkets. Often people say that it's cheaper to live in the countryside in Japan when compared to the city. So today I'm going to take you guys in this countryside supermarket and I'm going to pick out some regular day items that you would normally buy when grocery shopping and I'm going to compare those items with the ones in a Tokyo supermarket. Alright, let's go inside! Alright, so let's start with the vegetables. Price of vegetables depends on the product, but overall, I would say the countryside has slightly better pricing. Just look at all the selection behind me. And you won't find fresh fish like this in a Tokyo supermarket. So I notice a greater difference in price in the protein section. Fresh meat and fish are definitely cheaper in the countryside. Sashimi was hard to judge since the countryside offers large family packs where Tokyo offers smaller individual packs. All in all though, the countryside has a better value. so everything else was cheaper in the countryside except the rice. But there's not a huge difference. So it's true that the groceries are slightly cheaper in the countryside, especially when it comes to the meat and fish. In general though, the number of members in a countryside household are more than in the city. Thus, countryside supermarkets offer more value pack items, which helps lower the overall cost. If you were in Japan, where would you live? All right, so that concludes our video. Let me know what you guys thought about the prices compared to your country. If you guys like this video, help me out and hit that like button. And if you want to see more of my adventures in Tokyo or Japan, hit that subscribe button and the bell button, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.